Hello everyone, I am going to share how to encrypt and decrypt the data using Angular 17. So let's see the steps, what step will use to achieve this. Uh, basically, uh, I am going to use the Crypto.js here to uh, encrypt the decrypt your data. First, we will need to install the npm command to to Crypto.js and after that we'll use the save dev types as you can see here the commands. See uh, the in the first steps install the crypto.js using the CLI command. These command will help us to install the crypto.js. And after installed, we need to import the crypto.js. See here is the uh, import. And after that, we need to add the encrypt and decrypt method to encrypt your uh, data and decrypt your data with the help of a private key. Private key basically help us to uh, secure your data. I actually see here is I am using the crypto JS -E AES encryption method. Basically, this is the algorithm that we use. Here to encrypt and decrypt your data. Uh, in the final, I will uh, I will share the GitHub code that will help us to uh, understand. And let's come to the example how to achieve this. And see. Uh, here I I have already installed. Actually, I don't want to waste your time too much. So I have already installed the Crypto.js in our <coughs> project, and uh, I have created the user component. Where in the user component I will use to encrypt and decrypt the text. And this is the basically the encryption description service class I have created. First, I have installed after that created the service name of the service is encryption description service. And after after that, I have import the see here the crypto JS and I have created a private key. This private key basically help us to encrypt and decrypt the data. See here is the two method I have created the encrypt method and decrypt method. Encrypt method simply you pass the input. I have uh, created the input password so you can uh, need as per you the string or something. Uh, see here uh, the crypto JS AES algorithm will use to encrypt and your input key and this is the secure key that will be used you can decide as per you and write anywhere in your project and access here this uh, method basically help us to encrypt the data and the, see here the decrypt data the decrypted data will pass here and the data will decrypt with the help of your secure key let's see how to use this project is already running see here <coughs> here is basically i have created uh, a checkbox and on checkbox i am calling uh, the child component in the child component is in the child component i have uh, i have ug this service that we have created the encryption decryption service uh, this is the basically all the plain text that will uh, encrypt and decrypt here we can we can see in the constructor i am using the service that i have created the encryption decryption service and i see here is the ng on any method in this method, I have uh, logged the text. 
simple text that I am going to encrypt and here uh, I am using the encrypt method I am passing to the text that will go in to encrypt the data and the, after encrypt the, this will be stored here in the encrypt variable and the encrypt variable basically I will I am logging here console.log the in, encrypted these encrypted uh, text I will use to decrypt using the decrypt method that I have created in the service I earlier I explained I have mentioned two methods the decrypted text will store in the decrypted variable and log here see how to look like here I'm, I'm going to click on the uh, checkbox after checkbox the loading of the view here see here is the child view 1 and 2 component are loaded see here uh, in the console the password that I'm going to encrypt is system not 1 2 3 3 and the decrypted password is here you can see after that I uh, added this decrypted uh, password to encrypt again the uh, sorry the uh, encrypted password I'm going back to decrypt see here is the decrypted password this one is the encrypted password and this one is the decrypted password I hope you uh, got all the points so uh, I will share the source code from the github in the comment box in the video so you can download and see all the commands and code and experiment as well so I hope got my point thank you thanks for the watching and requesting you to please subscribe my channels and like as well also if you, you have uh, questions please uh, write in the comment box I will try to reply as soon as possible so thank you thanks for the watching